Hello everyone. Uh, today we got the 10 inch uh, compound sliding miter saw uh, from Chicago Electric and of course Harbor Freight. Don't forget to smash the like button, hit the subscribe, hit the bell icon and let's go ahead and get started. Uh, we got the, well I can't read it there but you can read it here. It says uh, Chicago Electric Power Tools uh, 10 inch sliding compound miter saw. It says uh, powerful 15 amp motor makes uh, precision cross bevel and miter cuts dual uh, linear slide rails for sorry guys I'm reading at an angle here uh, stability and smooth precise cuts 45 left bevel design so 45 degrees uh, left bevel design we got item number 61982 um, pretty much uh, I got this at the parking lot sale uh, I got it for $45 well not at the parking lot sale it's the June blowout sale it's the same thing uh, the parking lot sale so as you guys can see it is taped up so it's uh, previously uh, used or or returned not probably not used maybe we re just returned so uh, right let's get to the unboxing here Alright, as you guys can see, uh, it has the original packaging. Maybe the, not the original stuff, maybe not the blade. Um, some of the items here. But it does have the original packaging. Nothing here, just a bag with stuff in there, and no instruction manual at all. So, more bags. All right, guys, it looks like the bag hasn't been used, so I guess they did include a new bag in there. Um, they did include these uh, these brackets here, maybe some for these, uh, these metal brackets. I got both of them. So overall, it looks pretty good. You can tell that it's uh, somebody cut with this, so it's a little dirty. Just a little bit of dust, probably maybe from a single cut. The plastic, everything looks pretty good, like it's brand new basically. I don't see anything other details that. The metalwork seems to be okay little detail I don't know if you guys could see it on the screen I'll try to sum it in but uh, overall this seems like a, there's some paint issue here or something that's the only detail I could point out everything looks perfect um, even this looks like it's brand new so I guess maybe this this uh, miter saw was just returned you know to get a better one or they could have been they just uh, you know they just returned it and the guys opened it up and just make sure it works and resold it I guess in the parking lot sale let's go down to the 45 
looks pretty good to me. You guys see it? Pretty good nighty there. All right, let's do uh, 45. I would say right about there. I would say that's pretty cl close right there. Um, let me just put this up a little bit closer to the camera. You guys can see the gap. There's no gap in there. It's perfect. Well, um, lined up to the bottom and to the blade. So, um, seems like we're getting a good, uh, good angle there. The blade looks pretty new. Has an admirable blade. Maybe Harbor Fred just threw it in there. I don't know what kind of blades uh, these uh, saws come, but it does have an emerald uh, blade. Let's see here if I can read anything. It's a 5 8 uh, arbor size, 6,000 6, max RPM, general purpose, recommended application, fast rip, cross cuts, construction, hardwood, softwood, plywood, laminate. It's a 10 inch diameter of uh, 40 teeth ATB. So this is not a finishing um, finishing blade, but it, it does the job and it's you know should be okay for what I'm doing. It's otherwise when this blade goes bad I'm probably gonna get a Diablo or or maybe I just if I like this one I'll probably get another one. But um I'm pretty happy with this so far. We're gonna see uh, how well it does perform. I will be doing a few cuts and I'll measure them with this this angle tool, and uh, we're gonna see how this uh, this performs. And no no safety. Let me just turn this here. Turn this back to a 90 degree. Seems like on here. We don't have a, like a safety. All we do is have a trigger, slug spindle. So we'll try this out and see how this works. And we'll let you know, guys know if it's uh, actually doing the cuts that uh, what it's performed. I know I heard some bad things about this. Uh, maybe it's uh, one of the models previous to this model uh, that they were actually a little bit off, or this this wasn't working perfectly. Or this was bro broken. Um, but it seems to be right on the dot here. And there's no play either, so everything seems to be perfect. <laughs>